the White House threatens to veto a House Republicans bill that aims to provide standalone funding to Israel. The Office of Management and Budget expressed opposition, arguing that the bill inserts partisanship and could deprive humanitarian assistance to vulnerable populations, including Palestinians. House Republicans recently introduced their plan for a standalone bill aiming to provide $14.3 billion in aid to Israel. In contrast to Biden's $106 billion supplemental request that covered funding for Israel, Ukraine, Taiwan, and the southern border all in one bill, this plan would be fully financed by spending offsets. But here's the thing. The bill has received criticism for failing to address the urgency of the moment and deepening partisan divides. Critics argue that it undermines the historic bipartisan support for Israel's security, making our ally a mere pawn in our political landscape. Moreover, it denies much-needed humanitarian assistance to vulnerable populations, including Palestinian civilians, which is both a moral and strategic imperative. Those supporting the bill argue that requiring spending offsets to provide aid would establish a risky precedent by politicizing support for U.S. allies. However, opponents point out that this bill falls short in various areas. For one, it neglects the Pacific theater, weakening the U.S. response to China. Additionally, it fails to address the situation in Ukraine adequately. The Biden administration's response to the ongoing conflict in Israel following the attacks by Hamas on October 7th has drawn criticism from both the right and left. Progressive Democrats argue that the president is not doing enough to help Palestinians, while Republicans contend that Israel is not receiving sufficient support. Overall, this bill is seen as problematic for Israel, the Middle East region, and our national security as a whole. Don't forget to share your comments below and visit and share waynedupree.com for latest news and opinions. Follow us on social media platforms by searching for it, Wayne Dupree Show. Thanks for listening.